All right, Detroit Kings football team has been through some incredible ups and downs this year. You know that. Well, today they got a giant surprise from one of the best Detroit Lions. Brad Galley's here with more. Brad. Yeah, days before Detroit King began its quest to repeat as state champs, their head coach Dale Harvell died on the sidelines. But in his memory, the Crusaders honored their coach the best way possible this past fall by winning a second straight state title. So today at a school assembly, a surprise was awaiting them. Lions defensive end Ziggy Ansa walking through the doors. He received a letter from a King student about everything the kids went through these last few months. So Ziggy spoke to the students about overcoming adversity and tough times in life. Then he hosted a celebration in the best way possible with a pizza party. Ziggy pretty emotional talking about the visit. Um, you know, um, these are the little things that you know, makes me feel um, like I'm, I'm, I'm fulfilling the, the purpose that I have here in life. It's great for him to give back to us, teach us, give us lessons and stuff. Letting somebody know that people are still here for you. Just for him to come out here and give back to the kids. Gives the kids somebody to look up to and see what they need to do when they get older. I'm just coming out here and talk to these little kids. Um, it means a lot to me and I'm really honored to be here today. In here laughing when he says little kids because mm -hmm. he's so much bigger. I mean, those are big dudes, state champions. Carolyn, I know you were there doing a profile on Ziggy and this visit for our Monday night show coming up next week. Absolutely. I mean, he was so wonderful. The kids were so happy to see him. And the one little boy who wrote him that letter, it's just so surprising that a Detroit Lion would actually come off of a kid's letter and do a pizza party and everything like that for the kids. And he even talked about being a janitor and coming from Nigeria and all of the adversity mm -hmm. he had to overcome to mm -hmm. be where he is today. So he was quite inspirational today. He's one of a kind. I know everybody in house is very excited for our Monday night special we have next week. Lions and Cowboys right here on Channel 7. We're going to kick off our coverage at 7 o'clock on Monday. Be here and be ready. Our whole team is on it. Monday night football, primetime countdown right here on 7.